squad, though, is off-world. It's going to take a while to bring them in. Well, then, we'll have to make do with the tools we've got. You two, we can't risk those things getting out of the spaceport. I want you both on the next train there. We'll let them know you're coming and that you've dealt with these things before. Now go show them how it's done. The New Z's fleet must be the strongest out there. Now and always. There is no alternative. got here when you did. I... I just wish it hadn't come to that. Yeah, what the hell happened back there, Captain? There's no excuse for using lethal force here. Or you could have used the EM gun like you were ordered. These are lives you're playing with here, so get your head in the game, understand? Now, officer, the way those people were acting, I've seen this before. They were under the Terramorph's influence, weren't they? I... I don't know. They were down at the port, and they just started... screaming. We tried to restrain them, get them on the train to get them out of harm's way, but... but some of the other officers down there... we couldn't restrain them fast enough. They just... started firing on us. People we knew. They went berserk. Fermonic projection. Some Terramorphs, they can induce this fog. It affects everyone differently, but some people just lose control, turn against everyone around them, even if they don't want to. They're like a puppet. You kill the morph, you break the hold. But this means we're gonna need to be real careful with our fire and keep that EM weapon at the ready. Let's do it. Nat's unlocked. Please, do what you can to help them.
boats. We've got the remaining creatures locked down on the landing pad. We're barely holding our perimeter. They said you've done this before. Well, one fire team to spare and whatever supplies you need, but I, I can't risk them taking over any more money. Put those things down and do it fast. We hold them as best we can. Backup. You say the word, we're out there on your six. You two have any experience with Terramorphs before? Only the brief they just gave on the way here. But we know how to handle pressure. Surviving a full-on mental assault isn't the same as keeping your cool in a firefight. Might make you more liability than asset. We're not UC security. You don't need to worry about us. Roger that. We're on you. So lucky. Not in a million years. Another attack, just as we're making our request? It's insane. If this doesn't convince the cabinet to proceed with our request, I don't know what will. Almost hard to believe. Suppose we were just in the right place at the right time. so lucky the few protecting the many and it would have been plenty more if it hadn't been for the two of you the city owes you both a debt after this we were just in the right place at the right time captain we should report back to the president let her know the terramorphs have been dealt with take care of yourself sergeant
all know how much we owe them to them. Captain? Hey, Dran. It would appear that the Cabinet owes you our thanks for what you did for the city today. As well as an apology. Your concerns about the Terramorphs will consider them validated. Thank you, ma'am. Of course. I only wish we could have acted sooner. Now, today's events have only clarified our path forward in the eyes of the Cabinet. You will have our full support in collecting the Terramorph data from the Archives, as well as a subsequent investigation into the nature of these attacks. But to accomplish those goals, we're going to need the right people in the right places. As such, the Cabinet has authorized me to reinstate you, Hadrian, effective immediately, to your former rank of Major. As soon as we've got the data in hand, we want you investigating these attacks and how to stop them. Will you do this? I... Y yes Yes, ma'am. I'd be honored. Excellent. But as you've both made clear, for such an investigation to succeed first, we're going to need someone to convince the Free Star Collective and House Varun to play ball. Someone who knows precisely the sorts of dangers the colonies and all the galaxy are facing right now. The Cabinet wants you, Captain, to be that representative. We do. In exchange, we're willing to fast-track your citizenship upon collection of the data. So, will you help us? I'm glad to hear it. Now, we, of course, won't be sending you in without the proper support. Deputy McIntyre in the Office of Interstellar Affairs will be your guide on gaining access to the archives. You should be able to find her in her office across the hall. And on behalf of the whole of the United Colonies, you have our thanks. We are dismissed. Hey, I'm gonna go check in with Chief Engineer Kulkarni. Start getting...